Okay, as you can see, we have shaving cream can and a spray cheese can. I thought these would be really freaking awesome to watch them explode. And so we're going to shoot one with the 410 shell and we're going to shoot the other one with the 45 long colt. Let's see what happens. Okay, I always try to set this up as close as I can to the target, which actually isn't very close, but with what I've got, that's the best we can do. So, I think what I will do is shoot the 45 long colt first. Here we go. tell you I totally missed that I don't know what happened that kind of sucks usually I only need one bullet I'm gonna go grab another bullet and we'll shoot it again okay guys you'll see here as soon as I come around in front of the camera you see right here I got another 410 shotgun shell I'm thinking maybe what happened is, you know, it spreads out. I don't know. There's only three pellets in this thing because they're buckshot. But maybe I was too far back and it just didn't even hit the can. So this time I'm going to get a little bit closer to the can and see what happens. going on it's like it's not hitting the can but we're not sunk yet because I've got some better ammo well not, I don't know if it's better but I've got some different shotgun shells I'm gonna go grab one of those shoot this thing again There's no way we can miss it this time okay now I need to point out, just so you know, that black one that I was shooting, that was also a three inch mag. This one is a Winchester, it's a six shot, and it's only two and three quarters. But, I bet I can hit it with this one. Let's see what happens. Talk. 
up off that. We hit it right there and there and there and there. But I think what happened, there's some little exit holes right out the back right there. I think what happened when I was shooting that other herders, three inch magnum shells, from the looks of where I hit this, it was aiming down here. Being the shotgun, I don't know, but I think I was hitting up here a little bit high. There's a pellet right here, a pellet right there. Looks like a pellet right there. So this big hole right here is from that 45 long pole. Man, that's a big hole right there in the wood. Uh, I'll bring the camera over here so you guys can check that out. There's the lid off that shaving cream. Blew that thing away. I love shooting this gun. And I think I may just shoot it a couple more times, even off camera. So, I'm gonna come over here and show you. Here's the, oh, here's that orange can. Let's uh, pull this baby in here. There we go. There's the hole for the entrance. There's the exit hole. Punched a nice little hole out the back of it. Then we go over here. We've got our shaving cream can. You can see some of these little holes in the sides of it here. Well, those are the actual exit holes. We'll turn it around. You can see that some entrance holes there. Where's the one? Yeah. Anyway, right here, you see that? See that big hole right there? That's from the 45 Long Colt. This little hole, I don't know if that was already there or not. Not that it's little. I mean, it's pretty good size, but that may have even been some of those bullets from the I'm not sure there's a little one right there that might have been from the three inch mag too anyway that was a fun video you guys know um i was inspired to do these shooting videos because i watch a lot of shooting videos and i watch hootie who a lot so you guys want to go over to the hootie who channel and subscribe to that make sure you subscribe to my channel Kelly still and you guys have a good day it's a little longer than it was supposed to be but it's still cool and it was still fun thanks have a good day